So with water, perhaps more than any other element, we can't, you can't, you can't make wisdom happen. It's not like, hi-ho, hi-ho, it's off to work, we go, I'll internet search 500 things. <laughs> you know, like you can't, it doesn't, it doesn't go that way. It's a sitting in the dark that can't be hurried, but boy, we can sure slow it down. And so we're working with shifting the percentages inside of ourself from being mostly actively slowing down, getting to the point where we know what to do, right? I, I'm, I'm right here in this with you. Like times when like, as I inventory, what am I doing? I am actively slowing down the process of getting to wisdom by throwing fits and doing this and okay, at least we can be honest about and can we half ass three percent just a little bit of something that could compassionately grab a few of the swing votes and get them to commit to courting wisdom. Because I want to be very, very clear when we're talking about neurology and endocrinology, you can't dominate yourself into wisdom. You can't make your neurology and endocrinology be different. You can't be like, stillness. <laughs> you can't. All of neuroendocrine shifting, otherwise known in spiritual practice, is a matter of where are the swing votes here? I'm thinking specifically of maybe one of the most dramatic examples of this back when I taught classes in person, which was very, very fun. And I, I took public transportation to get there. I took a train down to New York City. Um, and I was, I had been so sick with a bronchitis and a sinus infection that kicked my ass so badly that I could barely make it onto the train. And I was so, so scared that I would not make it from Grand Central Station to the apartment where I was staying. And then like, and then I just wouldn't be able to teach this class. With the very clear understanding that my fear that I would not be able to teach this class was the greatest vector for not being able to teach the class. And that the only thing that this was, was going to make it possible for me to pull this off is to rest like never before. We all know, right, how hard it is to rest when it's like make or break. Calm down, <laughs> right? It's so hard. It's so hard. And I try and I tried so hard the bane of the water element trying to relax. Okay, I have to calm down. Okay, I have to get beneath the fear. I like I did I was like every single practice that I thought that I could do. It's like I'll do all of these things that I tell everybody to do and I'll really do them. And I just it was just awful. It was just a, a wild flying potpourri of practices that did not help. What I finally hit it on was the commitment to doing them only half ass 3%. And I said, I'm just going to come half ass 3% more down and that's it. That's it. Just tiny, like feeling my bones. Where are those bones? I don't feel any bones. I just feel this jitter. Can I find 3% bones? Not ask more of myself. Wait five or 10 minutes and ask for maybe can we do half as 3% more? Again, we're just working with the swing votes. We are not challenging anything that is in full bore, rah, 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 doing the other thing. Any swing votes, any little bit of me that can shift a little bit. And of course, all the voices are saying, you can't shift a little bit. You're going to have to shift tremendously. You have to shift a lot. This is a big emergency. You have to do that. It's like, these practices don't work unless you really do them. But I'm here to tell you that it went really well. 3% at a time. And that the only way, and every single time I was like, okay, it's working. 
I'm really doing it now. It stopped working. I had to be sneaking up on it the whole way. Life in the dark. Okay.